Each year, more than 2,000 tons of red king crab, equivalent to over 4.4 million pounds, are harvested from the freezing, volatile waters surrounding the Alaskan coast. These prized crustaceans bring in a staggering commercial value of up to $43 million annually. But what lies behind that number is not just a profitable industry. It is a battle, one fought against nature's fury in one of the most unforgiving marine environments on Earth. From the roaring gales of the Bering Sea to the icy decks of crab fishing vessels, the journey of the king crab is one of precision, tradition, danger, and resilience. It's not only a seafood delicacy, it's the result of relentless effort, centuries of maritime knowledge, and a profound respect for the ocean. Today, Agrotech Solutions takes you aboard the vessels, beneath the waves, and into the processing plants to reveal the untold story behind Alaska's king crab, an enduring symbol of luxury on dinner tables across the globe. Alaska's red king crabs are among the largest and most magnificent crustaceans in the world. With their hard, spiny exoskeletons, elongated legs that stretch wide across trays, and a vibrant reddish hue, they are unmistakable in both appearance and culinary reputation. Inside, the meat is tender, succulent, and naturally sweet. Qualities that have made it a staple in high-end seafood restaurants and specialty markets worldwide. The legs are the star of the show, and they are often served with minimal preparation, steamed, boiled, or grilled, preserving the flavor developed in nature's coldest waters. But these delicacies do not come easy. Harvesting them is not just a job, it's a seasonal race against time. The crab fishing season in Alaska runs from October through January. In these few short weeks, fishers must brave extreme weather conditions to seize the fleeting opportunity when crabs are most abundant and accessible. Before even setting foot on the open sea, crab fishing crews must conduct thorough preparations. Their vessels are specially engineered to navigate the harsh North Pacific. Reinforced steel hulls, thermal protected gear, and advanced radar and sonar systems ensure not only efficiency, but safety. Everything is tested. Mechanical arms, cranes, winches, navigational controls, all must be in flawless condition. The fishing gear is no less impressive. At the heart of the harvest are steel crab pots, durable cages that can weigh up to 800 pounds each. Designed with wide funnel-like entrances and internal bait compartments, these traps are built to catch only mature king crabs, leaving juveniles and other species unharmed. Crews load each pot with fresh bait, typically oily fish like herring or cod, 
and stack them high on the ship's deck. Once at sea, these traps will be dropped into the depths, reaching 200 to 600 feet below the surface. There, they wait silently in the cold darkness, luring crabs over hours or even days, depending on the conditions. Every move is calculated, every decision counts. Weather reports are studied obsessively, routes are mapped with care. In these waters, mistakes can be deadly. When it's time to haul the pots, adrenaline surges through the crew. The traps, now heavy with ice, salt, and possibly hundreds of pounds of live crab, are lifted from the seafloor by hydraulic cranes and swung onto the boat's deck. It's a high-stakes moment. Each pot is a gamble, sometimes full, sometimes empty. Crews move quickly, working with clockwork precision to sort the haul before the next pot surfaces. Each crab is measured and examined. Federal regulations require that only male crabs of a certain size can be kept. Females and juveniles are returned to the ocean to ensure the sustainability of the population. This careful selection is vital, not just for the health of the species, but for the future of the entire fishery. The risks don't end with the ocean. On deck, slippery surfaces, sharp claws and heavy machinery pose constant hazards. Add in sub-zero temperatures and powerful waves, and you have one of the most dangerous jobs in the world. Once sorted, the king crabs are placed in onboard holding tanks filled with chilled seawater. These tanks are more than containers, they are carefully controlled ecosystems designed to mimic the crab's natural habitat. Continuous water circulation ensures oxygen levels remain high, while stable temperatures reduce stress on the crabs. This not only keeps the crabs alive during transit, but preserves the quality of their meat. Stress, temperature fluctuations, or poor oxygenation can damage the crab's meat, dulling its natural sweetness and reducing market value. So every detail matters, from the depth of the water to its salinity. Even minor mistakes can compromise thousands of dollars worth of product. When the vessels return to port, the crabs are transferred to high-tech processing plants where the next stage begins. Each crab is again inspected, sorted and prepared for processing. Some crabs are sold live, others are destined for high-end markets where only the legs are sold. 
At this stage, precision takes over. Robotic systems equipped with specialized sensors and cutting blades separate the crab legs cleanly and efficiently, minimizing waste. The legs are then steamed, boiled, or gently cooked, preserving their natural flavor and extending shelf life. Next comes freezing, an essential step. Rapid freezing locks in moisture, flavor, and nutrients. Whether the product is bound for Tokyo, Paris, or New York, the freezing ensures that the customer experiences the same taste as if they were on the Alaskan coast. Some legs are vacuum-packed whole, ready for chefs seeking elegance on the plate. Others are trimmed and portioned for retail customers. Beyond the legs, there is the treasure inside, the delicate meat within the crab's body. This meat, often extracted manually or with delicate machinery, is cleaned, sorted and packed under hygienic conditions. In clean room environments, workers sort the meat by grade, carefully removing shell fragments or imperfections. Then, the meat is vacuum sealed into containers and frozen using specialized technology that maintains freshness without preservatives. These products are incredibly popular among consumers looking for convenience without sacrificing quality. Whether it's for crab cakes, sushi, or gourmet seafood dips, the extracted king crab meat carries the same luxurious essence as the full leg. King crab fishing in Alaska is more than just a seasonal trade, it's a legacy. Passed from one generation to the next, it reflects a deep understanding of the sea, a respect for natural limits, and a commitment to sustainable harvest. At its heart, this industry is a delicate dance between tradition and innovation, between exploitation and preservation. From the depths of the Bering Sea to the elegance of a five-star restaurant, every king crab leg tells a story. A story of extreme conditions, of resilience, of people who rise before dawn and face bitter cold just to deliver something perfect to your plate. At Agrotech Solutions, we believe that behind every harvest is a human story worth telling. Join us again as we continue to uncover the incredible, often unseen world of modern agriculture and seafood production. If this journey inspired you, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to explore more untold stories of resilience, innovation and flavor from around the world. Thank you.